मार सोभे मोर मुकुत तीर ऊपर सोभे कुंडल झल कतनी चलो मन गंगा जमुना तीर चलो मन गंगा जमुना तीर बजावत नाचे कनाई बंसी बजावे जहाँ नाचे कनाई संघली है बालवी संघली है बालवीर चलो मन गंगा जमुना तीर चलो मन गंगा जमुना तीर मीरा के प्रभु गिरधर नागरे मीरा के प्रभु गिरधर नागरे गिर धर नागरे गिरधर नागरे मीरा के प्रभु गिरधर नागरे चरण कमल धरुषी चरण कमल धरुषीर चलो मन गंगा जमुना तीर 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 ओ ृष्ण अंतरुद्रे सश्रित मूल तस्टो ब्रह्म मध्यमा गणस्पृत कुक्षा सप्तधीपा वसुंदरा ऋग्वीरामजुरवीरा साम वीराम थर्वना अंगे चा सहिता सर्वे कल सयंतु सामश्रित प्रेम सुर श्री कल स्वरुन्वटा की जय फाइनेंशियल प्रॉब्लम यू हैव यू प्रे Uh, if there's no financial problem, you still pray. Thank her. You thank her that she continues to bless you, uh, so that you know we're going through the world's going through crisis right now. So financially, because the resources are very important, as you know, to our uh, sustenance in life. So that we pray that we pray for the world also, not only for us, but for other people in our lives, people who you know, people you don't know. We pray for everyone here this morning. And may the light. And the blessings of this puja of Lakshmi Ma reach out to all of these folks in need around the world, all our children, and all the species as well. The Ma Mam Shatra Vinayashai, Arogya Sukha Sampada. May all sickness be removed from the body, and may Sukha and Sampati, joy, prosperity, reign in abundance. Om Namaste Tu Mahamaya, Shri Pite Sura Puja Te, Shankar Chakra Gada Haste, Mahalakshmi Namaste Te. नमस्तुते गरुडारुधे खोलासुर भयंकरी सड़पापम हरे देवी महालक्ष्मी नमस्तुते सर्वज्ञे सर्वरदे सर्वदुष्ट भयंकरी सर्वदुख हरे देवी महालक्ष्मी नमस्तुते सिद्धे बुद्धे पड़े देवी भुक्ति मुक्ति प्रदायरी मंत्र मूर्ति सरा देवी महालक्ष्मी नमस्तुते ओम हे लक्ष्मी करो तो कल्याण आरोग्यम सुख संपर मम शत्रु विनाशाय धीप ज्योति नमस्तुते या देवी सर्वूतेषु लक्ष्मी रूपेण संसदा नमस्त 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 नमो नम प्रेम सुर महालक्ष्मी माता की जय
जय ही महालक्ष्मी मा नैया मेरे पार करो जय महालक्ष्मी मा नैया मेरे पार करो झोली फैलाए करी झोली फैलाए करी मैया भंडार भरो नैया मेरे पार करो जय महालक्ष्मी मैया मेरे पार करो तू ही दयालु मैया ममता भरी लाखों दुखियों के तूने विपता हरी तू है दयाल मैया ममता भरी लाखों दुखियों के तू है विपता हरी हम भी आए शरण तिहारी हम भी आए शरण तिहारी हम तो दीप कर ध्यान धरो लक्ष्मी माँ नैया मेरे पार करो जय महालक्ष्मी माँ मेरे पार करो आई दिवाली आई दीपक जले तेरे कृपा हो तो सभी भूले भले दिवाली दीपक जले तेरे कृपा हो तो सभी फूले फले सुख संपत्ति से घर घर जाए सुख संपत्ति से घर भर जाए इतना का महालक्ष्मी मैया मेरी पार करो मेरे पार करो झोली फैलाए करी झोली फैलाए करी मैया भंडार भरो जय महालक्ष्मी मैया मेरे पार करो जय महालक्ष्मी मैया मेरे पार लक्ष्मी नम स्वाहा ओम धन लक्ष्मी नम स्वाहा विद्या लक्ष्मी नम स्वाहा संता लक्ष्मी नम स्वाहा योग लक्ष्मी नम स्वाहा भोग लक्ष्मी नम स्वाहा महालक्ष्मी माता नम स्वाहा हरि प्रिय नमस्तुभ्यं नमस्तुभ्यं दया निधि लक्ष्मी ज्योति परम ब्रह्म लक्ष्मी ज्योति जनादना लक्ष्मी हरतमा पापम सर्वलक्ष्मी नमस्तुते या देवी सर्वभूतेशु लक्ष्मी रूपे न संसिता नमस्तस्ये 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 नमो नमः प्रेम सुर लक्ष्मी माता की जय नो रेन इज कमिंग फ्रॉम दिस स्काई क्या कहते नहीं बेहतर इन दिस राइट सो वेन वी सेट दिस पूजा वी डिट नो दिस वेर टू बी लाइक दिस बट गंगा मे गंगा माँ मेर इज पॉसिबल शी नोज वी ऑल गोन कम हेर दिस पॉडी वी गोन सिट हेयर आई वी नीड टू बी कम्फर्टेबल सो शी शी ऑर्गेनाइज एवरी थिंग सो दैट यू कैन बी Uh, sit in this manner here and perform the puja without any complaints. So you can't say, "Well, this thing is too hot." You can't say it's too cold. This is, are you are you feeling the chill? This is like natural AC you get in here. Yes. You don't have to pay for it. Isn't that so? Natural AC you get. So 
you can't get any better. See, Ma, she really is a really is a way, as you know. When you have a desire to perform the puja like this, then Ma makes it happen. She makes it possible. How are you all feeling good this morning? Coming into Ganga Ma? Good energy feeling? Yeah, you feel better energy just now when we get in this puja here. And my godson is here. Paguji is here. All be beneficial to us. So if you're going through any kind of graha at this time, if, the, if the, the, the planet is not auspicious in your horoscope, so we pray that may the blessings of this puja this morning will neutralize all its negative effects and the, all the graha devtas will bless us in turn. Uh, Shani, Rahu, Ketu, Mangal, all the devtas uh, will bless us so that uh, whatever is going wrong will become right eventually. So let us pray now to Suri Bhagwan, now graha devtas. Oma Krishna Narasang Bhartamanu Divishang Brita Matasham Hiranena Sabita Rathi Nadi Vayating Bhavana Nupashan Om Bhurbhuvaswaka Sapsakutra Miha Gaksham Miha Tishtam Sri Surya Yenamaha Om Ya Imam Deva Aswaramanathayang Shubhagwang Mahati Chatray Mahati Jishtay Mahati Jan Raja Im Demilisya Putramasi Sumaraja Smakam Brahmanana Kwam Raja Bhuraswam Chandra Yenamaha Om Agni Mudhanam Kakurpati Vang Siva Jivantya Pagvam Pratavyayam Varaswam Bhavamaya Namaha Om Udbudhyam Swagning Pratichagrahitam Ishtam Puriting Sagvam Sajita Mayam Cham Asmin Sarasti Ajyotarasmin Vishwedi Vam Sajatman Sirtar Swam Budhaya Namaha Om Brihaspati Atiyadhi Dutumajinechum Dharasamaa Sutravinam Dejitram Swam Brihaspati Namaha Om Mannatam Pritumanana Gvam Raja Shukmanasa Shukravar Swam Shukraya Namaha Om Shanno Devi Ravishyam Apu Bhavundu Bhitai Shanno Ravi Shravanduna Vodaswam Shanishraya Namaha Om Kayana Shitranga Bhavartu Kayam Shishtya Viram Saravira Sakha Vodaswam Rahavi Namaha Om Ketukranvanda Ketavi Peshumaniyang Apisimur Jayatha Vodaswam Ketavi Namaha Brahma Murari Sripuran Jakari Banu Shashi Bhumi Suto Purhascha Gurusta Shukra Shani Rahu Ketava Sarvi Graha Shanti Kara Bhavantu Prem Surasvi Suryari Nau Grahari Devata Ki Jai Well, you have Nau Graha Bhajan. Now, in case I forget, please remind me. I want to tie this string in everybody's hand. All of you who are here this morning. We have enough for everybody. So before we leave, this puja finish. There's a blessing with Puja this morning. We keep this on for the whole year. Everyone. All right, there. Bhajan, we do now Graha Puja. Om Namo Bhagavati Surya Inama. Om Namo Bhagavati Surya Inama. Surya Inama.
नील वरण वर है यसवारी ज्ञान निधान प्रेम व्रत धारी सासु कथा मैं कहूँ बखानी गम पारा दीन भुवन जहि रवि उजियारा दीन भुवन जहि रवि उजियारा आदित कथा पुनी तयति गाव ही शंभु सुजान दीन लोक छवि ज्योति में करो प्रताप बखान ओम जपा कुसुम सं कश्यम कश्यपे यं महावृद्धि तमोरी सर पापघ्नो तस्वाकर शंकाषाराभं शीरूाणम संभव नमा शचिन सोम शंभु मुकुटभूषण धरनी गर्भ संभूत मुच्चुकाभं कुमार शक्ति हस्त तंग मंगल प्रणमा प्रंगु कलिका श्यामा रूपीना परमंगुम सौम्यं सम्युगुणुपीतम तंग बुद्धं प्रणमा देवा चारिषीण चा गुरु कांचन सन्निभं बुद्धिभूत तिलोकेशम तन्मा बृहस्परी मकुंदमालाभम दैत्याना परमं गुरु सर्वशास्त्र भागव प्रणमा नीलांजन सामभास कविपुत्र यमागजं छाया माटं समुत तनमा शनिश्वर अयडकार्य महावीर चंद्राज मदम सिंह का गर्भ संभूत तम राहु प्रणमा पलाशपुरशं काशम तारकाग्रहमस्तक रौद्रंग रौद्रामक घोरम तंग के प्रणमा ब्रह्मा मुरारी सिपुराकारी भानु शशी भूमि सुटो बुधश गुरु से शुक्र शरीराहु केतु गुणवंतु सर्वे मम सुप्रभात प्रेम सुरुषि सूर्य भगवान की प्रेम सुरुषि नवग्रहारी देवता की जय Uh, when we have Ganga Puja, we also worship. Take it, sir. Put it down. 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 Put it and you will to discover where the actual source of ganga is is all the way up there in the abode of shiva ji himalayas as well so uh, there is a place called uttarakhand there where you find the gangotri it begins like a little pond and that rock where bhagirath uh, stood is the pavam tapasya is still there so in that spot the ganga is born and from there from a little pond she begins to flow and as she flows down this mountain no other small rivulets and streams unite with her and then it becomes a river and then more rivers flow into her as well and it flows all the way out to ganga sagar which is the bay of bengal and i i was there there is the ganga sagar where you see the ganga ma flowing into the ocean and she becomes ocean after that the same water and that same ocean arrives here wherever we are so wherever you are wherever you uh, see a body of water that is ganga ganga mama where is a lake where is a river where there is the ocean where is a stream uh, where is a puddle that is the presence of ganga mama water is ganga so we pray to bhagwan shiva this morning lord shiva among other things he is the symbol of peace tranquility He is the Mahadev, foremost amongst all the devas, and he is called the destroyer, the dissolver of the entire universe. At the end of every kalp, every cycle of time, the universe recedes back into the form of Lord Shiva, and then is released afresh in a new generation of life. So, with clasped hands, let us meditate now for a few moments and with Lord Shiva. O oh Lord. 
you are Shankara, you are Mahadev, you are all merciful, you are all forgiving, you are all compassionate. Whoever comes to your doors, O Supreme Shiva, never leaves empty-handed, never leaves disappointed, never leaves dejected, but always full, saturated with your love and your mercy. We pray on behalf of all of us here this morning, on behalf of our respective families, uh, on behalf of our extended families as well, on behalf of our mandir, of this entire community, of this entire nation, of the world. And those who are joining us also on live stream, wherever you may happen to be, we pray as well, with blessings of Bhagwan Shiva be with you, as you join us in prayer too this morning, for your, for your loved ones and yourself. The world needs that of prayer, needs the blessings of Bhagwan Shiva as we speak. O Lord, who art merciful and compassionate, may you hearken to these humble petitions of ours this morning. Bestow your love, your mercy and blessing upon us. Rid us of all the impurities uh, accumulated, coming into contact with the external world, with the sense object of the world. May that powerful name of yours that purifies and edifies and uplifts and liberates, may that name, O Lord, bring us abundant peace and bliss. Please a chant, Om Namah Shivaya. Om Namah Shivaya, the king of all the mantras dedicated to Bhagwan Shiva. Om Namah Shivaya. Everybody. Om Namah Shivaya. 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 Om Namah Shiva is that powerful formula that rids the mind of stress, that rids the mind of worry, that lowers your blood pressure, tranquilizes you. You meditate on that Supreme Shiva in this mantra, Om Namah Shiva. He embodies the mantra, Om Namah Shiva. We invoke His divine presence in our hearts by the simple recitation of Om Namah Shiva. Om Namah Shivaya Om Namah Shivaya Shivam Bhavatu Kalyanam Arugyam Sukha Sampara Dushta Buddhi Vinashaya Shivakaraya Namu Namaha Haro Maheshwara Shambhu Shula Pani Pidagrika Pashu Patim Harisheva Mahadeva Mitim Rita Karapura Gauram Karuna Vataram Sansara Saram Bojagindraharam Sadava Santam Hidayara Vindi Bhavam Bhavani Sahitam Namami Another powerful mantra is called the Mahamrityu Anjai Mantra. Anyone you know who is sick, if you yourself experiencing sickness, anyone who is going through any difficulty at this time, any physical, mental, emotional troubles at this time, the power of the Mahamrityu Anjai Mantra indeed reaches out to resolve these issues. So let us all chant together that Maha Mrityanjai Mantra dedicated to Bhagwan Shiva. Mrityanjai means the conqueror of death. When you are standing at the doorstep of death, Bhagwan Shiva through his miraculous powers of his mantra wards off such anomalies in your life. Om Trayambakam Yajamahe Sugandhim Pushti Vairdhanam Purvarukami Mabandhanam Mrityur Mokshiyamamrita 
ಕಂಜಾಮಿ ಸುಗಂಧಿ ಪುಷ್ಟಿವರ್ಣನ ಉರ್ವಾರುಕಮೇವನ ಮೋಕ್ಷೀಯಮೃತ ಮಹಿ ಸುಗಂಧಿ ಪುಷ್ಟಿ ವೈಢನ ಪ್ರೇಮಸುಲಭಾಪತಿ ಮಹಾದೇವ ಕಿ ಜೈ ಓಂ ನಮ ಶಿವಾಯ 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 ಬ್ರಹ್ಮ ಮುರಾರಿ ಸುರಾಚಿತ ನಿರ್ಮಲ ಭಾಸಿತ ಶೋಭಿತ ಲಿಂಗ ಜನಮ ಜದೂಖ ವಿನಾಶದ ಲಿಂಗ ತತ್ ಪ್ರಣಮಿ ಸದಾ ಶಿವ ಲಿಂಗ ಓಂ ನಮ ಶಿವಾಯ 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 ದೇವರಿ ಪ್ರಭರಾಚಿತ ಓಂ ನಮ ಶಿವಾಯ 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 ಓಂ ನಮ ಪಂಕಜಹಾರ ಶೋಭಿತ ಲಿಂಗ 
कंचित पापनीशन लिंग तत् प्रणमामी तदा शिवलिंग ओम नम शिवाय 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 ओम देवगणार्चित देवित लिंगम भावर भक्ति मेरे वचलिंग दिन कर कोटि प्रभाकर लिंग तन प्रणमामी तथा शिवलिंग ओम नम शिवाय 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 अष्टलो परिवेशलिंग पर्वत मुद भव कालिंग अष्टरेत्र विनाशन लिंग तत् प्रणमामी तदा शिवलिंग ओम नम शिवाय 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 सुर गुरु सुर वर पूरी सलिंग सुर वन पुष्प सदराज परा परम पर महात्म कलिंग कर प्रणमामी सदा शिवलिंग ओम नम शिवाय नम शिवाय ओम 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 I'm not afraid. 
भस्मांगराय महेश्वराय निताय शुद्धाय दिगंबराय तस्म नकाराय नम शिवाय मंदाकिनी सरचंदन चरचिताय नंदीश्वर प्रमथनाथ महेश्वराय मंदार पुष्प पुष्प पूजिताय तस्म मकाराय नम शिवाय शिवाय गौरी भजना चृंदा सूर्याय दक्षा रुजनाशकाय श्रीनीलकंठा वृषध्वजा तस्म शिकाराय नम शिवाय वशिष्ठ कुंभ भवगौतमाया मुनेन्द्र देवाजित शेखरा चंद्राक वैश्वा नरलोचनाय तस्म वकाराय नम शिवाय यज्ञस्वूपा जटाधराय पिनाक हस्ताय सनातनाय देवाय दिव्याय दिगंबराय तस्म यकाराय नम शिवा ओ नम शिवा बोलो महापरि महादेव की जय अरे शोर्स ऑफ योशन इज टोटली डिफरेंट इन इट एवरीबॉडी एग्री यस या एंड दोस यू आर वाचिंग एज वेल यू विल एग्री विद मी सो यू नो बैक इन द डेज व्हेन अ द सेंट एंड सेजेस यू टू गैदर when there was no physical building this is how the satsang used to be under a tree even our ancestors when they came out of india they went and they settled in the caribbean and the other places when there was no physical structure physical mandir they sat on the trees or in open parks open area they did the round leela remember the round leela they dramatized that in the open air Mahabharat, all of this, and that was uh, the main source of both entertainment and education. And the scriptures. So, the the teacher or the the learned saints, they would sit in this manner, and the all the disciples would be around. and he was gives he would give the uh message if you look at his, his our scriptures for example tears like naimi shaad the naimi shaad is here like the forest of naimi shaad the ganga flows he would sit at the banks of the ganga 
and they will have this discourse is going on. For example, in the Srimad Bhagavat Mahapurana, when Raja Parikshit was there listening to the Bhagavatam, Sri Shukdeva Muni, he was right, sitting like this. You just imagine sitting like this, where the Sri Shukdeva Ji was seated, and all these sentence sages were there, and he was dictating the Srimad Bhagavatam to them. So, you just feel, condition in mind, that, you know, you're in one of those holy shrines, holy pilgrimages, and uh, we are here to, to participate in this puja this morning. So it is said in the scriptures that wherever Ganga Ma flows, that's what becomes holy. If Bhagavan Sri Ram, after he finished constructing this bridge to Lanka, it was a situation like this, at the shores of the ocean. And there he said, Parama Ramya Uttamya Dharani Mahima Amit Jai Naivarani. That this spot is so holy, it is so delightful that no amount of words can describe it. And of course he knew what he was talking about. And we know what he's talking about. If you experience it for yourself, when you come to the shores of the ocean or to the banks of the Ganga, and you get that feeling because you're in, you see, what you may not notice, but you're sitting here in this manner. You're physically in touch with Mother Nature. Now, we have a roof over our head. That is the roof. The sky is a roof. That's the canopy of our head. We have a lower canopy with this tree here, sheltering us as well. All these are gifts of Mother Nature. The tree is very beautiful feature. Where is Rusat? Rusat, where is it? Come here. Tell us about the, the beauty of this tree. Because Rusat was sitting under this tree a couple of weeks ago. Take your shoes off. Rusat is my uh, godson, he's my sister. One of brilliant attorneys, uh, just graduated from England, just uh, returning here. And we had a puja here a couple of weeks ago, and I was giving him some lessons about this importance of this spot. We were sitting at the same spot right here. So tell us something about this Rusat before we begin our puja this morning. Well, well, we were sitting under this tree a few weeks ago, as, as, uh, as Guruji said just now, and we're doing this Ganga puja, and we're talking about how uh, if you think in, in ancient India and, and, and just the tradition in general, the, uh, between a guru and a shishya, the, the image uh, in our religion always is that, that you have these d discussions under, under the tree, the, the, the teachings that the guru passes on to the, 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 the student, the shishya, or just in general the devotees. It, it takes place in this setting and uh, even in New York as a, or we go to Mandir normally by being here in this setting this is that traditional way that we're upkeeping now and, and it was a, a special moment and we had our discussions and he was uh, you know passing on knowledge as, as a guru does and, and we, we were having it in that in that manner that day that morning yeah, yeah thank you very much Rusat give Rusat a big hand yeah. You know, one day, Lord Krishna and Balram, uh, when they were on earth, they were with the gopis, and they, uh, it was a very hot day. The sun was, you know, was, was beaming down on them. And then they took shelter under a tree, like this tree, for example. And they're lying on the ground, and Bhagavan Krishna is looking at this tree. And all these gopis were around him. And then he begins to tell them, these gopis, and in so doing, he's educating all of us how important this tree is. <clears throat> now, as Hindus, we see God in everything, in all his creation. And it's a very beautiful line in the Ramayana that says, Santa Bitta Pasarita Giri Dharani, Parahita Hetu Sabanlai Karani. Five things are mentioned here. Sant Vitap Sarita Giri Dharani. The Sant means the saint. The Vitap means a tree. The Sarita means the water, the river, the ocean. Giri means the mountain. And Dharani means the earth. So here we have the saint, the tree, the water, the mountain, the earth. Sant Vitap Sarita Giri Dharani. And these exist for a specific reason. Parahita He Tu Sabanlai Karani. They all exist for the sake of others. The saint exists for the sake of others. The tree exists for the sake of others. The water for the sake of others. The mountain for the sake of others. 
the earth for the sake of others. Now let us explain it. He said to someone who would sacrifice himself, he would endure pain himself to rid others of their pains. He would make that sacrifice to rid other people of their pains. So he is a saint. Now the tree also, the tree would rather choose to bear the brunt of the heat of the sun so that we could be sheltered beneath his branches. Isn't that so? Then the tree would bear all these fruits, like a mango tree, for example. And does the tree ever eat one of those fruits? Not even one. The tree doesn't say, look, I'm going to keep this bunch for me. I'm going to keep this one for me. I'm going to give the rest other, but this belongs to me. If the tree did, you will understand it. Say, of course, you deserve that more, much more than that. The tree gives every single fruit away. The tree is so compassionate that if you throw a rock at the tree, it gives you a fruit in return. You know, you little boys, you go to school, you get these rocks and you throw it. Little girls too. You throw, you know, you want a mango, how you can do it? You take a stick and you throw it at the tree and the rock, and the, the tree what it does. The tree doesn't get angry, it gives you a mango in return. That's how compassionate the tree is, see? Also, if you look, this, this tree is such a great teacher. And because we sit on the tree, we learn something about the tree. That is why we worship the tree. This tree feeds you. From the bark of the tree, you can make clothes, clothing, right? So it, shall, it clothes you also. The tree shelters you, not only like this, but the lumber of the tree also builds houses and shelters you. So the, the tree feeds you, it clothes you, it shelters you. Then when you die, the tree cremates you also. The same wood, the thing to cremate you, dispose of your body. So you look at this tree, the tree sustains you in every aspect of your life, fulfills all your needs. Now the tree educates you also, because out of the, the, the bark of this tree you make paper, and in the paper knowledge is written, right? Books are made out of the, the tree, so that you can learn. So the tree teaches you also. See how important the tree is? The sun to beat up. That is why we worship the tree. You worship the Tulsi tree. You worship the male tree, the mango tree. You worship the tree because we see God is present in the tree. God fulfills all our needs through these manifestations. Sun to beat up. Sarita. Sarita means the river. The river flows. The, water, the river never drinks its own water. Nadi na piya kabi apna jal, breaksha na khaya kabi apni phal. So, the animals will drink of the water. We will drink of the water. The insect will drink of the water. The birds will drink of the water. The tree doesn't drink. It. The river doesn't drink its own water. So the river flows for the sake of others as well. Santa Bita Sarita. Giri. Giri means a mountain. Now this mountain also exists for the sake of others. Mountains have specific roles. They, they regulate the climate, climatic conditions. For example, in India, because of the mountains, the, the trade winds, you get this, this monsoon rains and brings uh, irrigation uh, to, the, to a dry, ordinarily dry country. The mountain also bears jewels and gems that, that it, it releases you know, through streams and rivers and we become beneficiaries of them as well, the minerals, so many things. Also, they are, they are known as uh, agricultural pasture lands and so forth. Santvita Sarita Giri and Dharani, Mother Earth. Mother Earth also exists for the sake of other. The Earth gives so compassionate. You plant one seed in the ground, the Earth gives you many fruits in return. And the Earth is Dharati Mata. She feeds us, she protects us, she receives us also when we go. Now, if you look at this line carefully, Santa Vita Sarita Giri Dharani. All of these five that I just mentioned, they are preceded by this word Sant, which is saint, which means that the tree, the mountain, the river, and the earth, they are all equated to the level of the saint. They become saintly as well. So the tree becomes the saint, the earth becomes the saint, uh, the, tree, the river becomes the saint, the mountain becomes the saint, because they are all in the same category of the saint. This live for the sake of others, for all of us. So that is why, as Hindus, we believe, if there's any tradition at all, any religion at all on the face of this earth that truly believes and practices environmental conservation or preservation, uh, the respect of the environment and non-pollution, uh, it is the Hindu tradition. 
You know, you go to India, you got to, in order for you to pick a leaf of the tree, uh, there's a certain ritual, a mantra that you must read. And after certain hours, you can't, you can't pick leaves of the trees. After six, for example, the tree goes to sleep. If you want a vegetable, you got to wait till the next day. You can't go pick it. You have to have respect for the tree. Because the tree is like a person. See? So, we believe in protecting the environment. We believe that the environment is very sacred to us. That is the reason why when we come to the Ganga, and you make your offerings to the Ganga, you must not put into the water uh, things that will pollute the water, like foil and foam and these things. It is not right. Not only the Ganga, even the earth, you must not litter the ground and throw paper and throw things out of your car and litter the earth. You must have respect for Dharati Mata, Mother Earth as well. There are certain places where you put these things in the garbage where, where it belongs. You must not litter the ground. You must not litter the waterways. You must not abuse the tree. See, these are what our dharma teaches us. Because God is present in all of these objects, in all of these manifestations. So this morning, we welcome here to worship this form of Ma, which is Ganga Ma. And Ganga Ma has many, many miraculous powers, which I shall tell you about uh, while we perform this puja here this morning. But I know that all of us have come here because we're all devotees of Ganga Ma. And all of you watching us, you're devotees of Ganga Ma as well. So this morning we will uh, commence our puja to the Devi Ganga, who is uh, very, very merciful, very loving, compassionate to all of us, and ever responsive to all of our prayers and petitions. So let us uh, clasp our hands and let us uh, meditate on this form of Ganga Ma. Now, before us is the living murti, is water. That's the murti of Ganga Mata. We also have a physical murti here of Ganga Ma as well. And let us pray to Ganga Ma. Again, whatever is going on in your life, pray for your loved ones, pray for your children, pray for your husband, your wives, pray, pray for your grandchildren, pray for your, your friends, your family, anyone who may be sick, anyone who has any kind of difficulty, any trial, tribulation going on in your life right now. Let us pray for everyone. Ganga Ma answers prayers and she answers prayers instantly, immediately. She responds. She comes true for all her devotees and she will certainly come true for all of us here this morning. I'm pretty sure because as we hear, what is required is devotion in our heart. And once you have that devotion to port at lotus feet, it moves Ganga Ma to respond positively. Devotion in our hearts, let us meditate on Ganga Ma. Pray to her. Om. Ganga Yenamaha Om Ganga Punati Bhalam Reva Kati Pradesham Bandi Sada Swadesham Eta Desham Swadesham Kashi Prayaga Matura Rinda Kavani Vishala Dwaravati Sukanjin Vivida Shambhushanti Kamam Yasya Prashanta Vesham Vande Sada Swadesham Eta Yasam Swadesham Sarilan Sudham Turitam Pavano Pigandavahi Charitam Vikalpa Kalitam Dharmo Daya Bhagahim Yet Prankanam Shabalitam Kato Ali Rishisham Vande Sada Swadesham Eta Drisham Swadesham Kayam Tiyasyadeva Shubhagita Kani Nityam Sarve Bhavantu Sukhino Yasyaita Deva Prithyam Abhaya Prado Padesham Shamayanti Papalesham Bandi Saras Vadesham Etradrisham Swadesham Achalo Tu Devatam Mam Basura Pirat Nagarva Kunishayate Yadasti Pachurangvani Sudurvam Kechinam anti girijang, Kechinam shalu vesham, Bande saras vadesham, Gita desham vadesham, Adhyapi asya nirdhing, Visma patyam tanilapam, Udhyausham vishva shanting, Avancham itra kalapam, Bande dvajam trivaranam, Bande grihita kesham, Bande saras vadesham, Gita desham vadesham, Om Sri. Ganga Yenamaha, Shri 
श्री गंगाए नम भागीरथी माताय नम श्री गंगाए नम ओ श्री गंगाए नम श्री गणेशाय नम श्री गंगा नम विनियोग गंगा कवच से विष्णु ऋषि कृपा चंदा चुषा पुरुषा उदारम अत्यंबार विनियोग ओं दिव्य रूपा महाभागा श्राणी चर्पणी पिछा अभिषेक पूजनी चाचमा शुक्रूपिणी विष्णु पारा प्रसुता वैष्णवी नाम धारिणी पाईमा सर्वत रक्षे गंगा त्रिपत गामिनी मंदाकिनी सरा पाचु देहांटे स्वर्ग वल्लभा अलकनंदा चवा भागे प्रतम्यां या चुतिष्ठरी भोगवती चपाताले स्वर्ग मंदाकिनी तथा पंचाक्षर मंत्र या पति श्रुणियारे रोगी रोगा प्रमुच्ये बद्धोमुचते बंधना गुणवीण जनीता पुत्र बंध्या पुत्रवती भवि गंगा स्मरमात्रेण निष्पाप जायते नर यह पतेत मध्ये तो गंगा स्नान फल लभेत स्नान काले पतेजस्त शरकोटी फल लभेत या प्रयत्न भयत भक्तिया मुक्ता कोटी कुले सह इति श्री विष्णु नाम रे शिवा संभारे गंगा कौचम संपूर्ण प्रेम सुर श्री गंगा माता की भागीरथी माता की ओम हर हर गंगे हर हर गंगे माता तेरे पुण्य पदो में जन्मे त्रिभुवन शीश झुकाता भागीरथ ने जिगर भक्ति से अपना शंख बजाया उसे पंच को पति पावनी मां तुमने अपनाया हरिद्वार काशी प्रयाग को तुमने तीरथ बनाया आज हमारे जीवन परमा दुख का बादल छाया करो धारे गंगे तुम ही करो ब्रह्म 
गंगे हर हर गंगे इस देश की बहतान है गंगा बहतान है गंगा हर हर गंगे हर हर गंगे हर हर गंगे हर हर गंगे हर हर गंगे
गंग जय शिव जटा निवासिनी अनुपम तुंग जय जय जननी हर नय खानी आनंद करनी गंग महारानी जय भागीरथ सुर सरी माता कलिमल मूल जल नी क्या जय जय जहन सुधा जननी भीष्म की माता जग जननी कबल कमल जल मन सागे लगी चत चर दंग चबिरागे वाहन मकर विमल जुटी सोहे 
हमी अकल कर लगी मन मोहे जर तर भूषण यमनी हार हर निकम रोचन जग पावनी त्रेतापन पावनी तरल तरंग तुंग मन पावनी जो गणपति अति पूज प्रधारा के प्रथम गंगा यमक मंडल वासी देवी श्री प्रभु पर पंकज सुख देवी साधि सहस्र सागर सुख चार्यो गंगा सागर तीरथ धार्यो अगम तरंग उद्यो मन भाव लगी तीरथ हरिद्वार सुहाव तीरथ राज प्रयाग सेवत हरिमा कुकुनी काशी करवत धनी धनी सुर सरी स्वर्गति सीरी तारणी अमित पितु पद सीरी भागीरथी तप कियो पारा तव सुर हरिधारा जब जग जननी चलो हराई शंभु वर्ष पर्यात गंग महारानी रई शंभु के जटाणी पुरी भागीरथी शंभु ही ध्याय सुंद जगा से पायो साते माटु भई त्रे धारा मृत्यु लोक न भवर पारा कई पताल प्रभाव की नामा मंदा की गई गगन ललामा मृत्यु लोक गई सुहावनी कई मन पान करत निर्मल गंगा जल पावत मन पूर्व जन्म पुण्य जब जागत कभी ज्ञान गंगा महला कई पग सुर सरी हे तो थावे सजी जगश्म मेर फल पावे महापति जन का सारे दिन सारे नाम तिहारे कतो जन से जो ध्याव निचल विष्णु लोक पद पाव नाम भजत यगनितयगराचे विमल ज्ञान बल बोधि प्रकाशे विधन मूल धर्म और दारा धर्म मूल गंगा जल पारा सब गुण गुण कर सुख भाज गृह गृह संपति सुमति विराज रंग ही नीम सहित नित ध्यावत दुर्जन हूँ सजन पद पाव बल पावे रोगी रोग मुक्त हो जावे गंगा गंगा जो नर कही भूखा नंगा तब हो न रहे निकसत ही मुख गंगा माही लवन गाबी जम चल ही पराई मरण अभिनय धमन कह तारे भय नरक के बंद तिवारी जो नर जप गंगा शत नामा सकल से पूरन है कामा सब सुख भोग परम पद पावे आवा गवन रहित धनी मैया सुर सरी सुख दैनी 
धनी धनी तीरथ राज त्रिवेणी तकरा ग्राम ऋषि दुर्वासा सुंदर दास गंग कर राजा जो यह परे गंग चालीता मिले भक्ति अविरल वीता मिले भक्ति अविरल वीता नित से सुख संपत्ति लहे धरे गंग का ध्यान अंत समय सुरपुर बसे सादर बैदी बीमा सम्मत भुज नव दिशे राम जन्म दिन चैत पूरन चालीसा किया हरि भक्तन जितने प्रेम शोर श्री गंगा माता की भागीरथी माता की As you can see, isn't that beautiful? Is that telling us something? As now is blessings. So they finished. It couldn't happen before. So they finished Ganga Chalisa. Bhagwan Surya appeared to give us darshan. Even though many of you would have preferred it to remain cloudy. Well, <clears throat> respected pandit here, pandit Amiji, pandit Dilan is here. Our pandit here. Our beloved Shrota, Shrota Agan. Shankar Parivar uh, and all of you wonderful devotees who are here joining us this morning. Jai Shri Ram, Jai Ganga Ma. Indeed, a very uh, great privilege, an opportunity for us all to be here today to join together in this uh, our annual Ganga Puja. As you know, for a couple of years we didn't get a chance because of the pandemic. So last year we couldn't do it the year before. But uh, nonetheless, we got our permit this year. So all of you are legal here. Everybody's legal. We got our permit to assemble here today and to join together in the worship of Ganga Ma. Well, a lot of good things happen. You see, normally, sometimes you come to the water and it is, the level is very low. That's so why she came up this morning. The water is high. You can go. When you finish, you go and you make our offerings and prayers and so on. And, uh, Take the blessings of Ganga Ma. Now, uh, the Ganga Puja is very important. How many of you went to India? Put your hands up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Huh? Ten and us, thirteen. Means us mean fourteen. We'll have to go in there soon. Now, <clears throat> the, the rest of you who didn't go, Beside the 14, the rest of you didn't go. You need to go. And we're going to plan a trip sometime. And one reason why we could plan a trip because we want to go to the Ganga itself, to the shores of Ganga Ma. We're going to go to Rishikesh and Haridwar. And Rishikesh is very, and uh, Kashi. Kashi is uh, Banaras. And, uh, these are very important places of pilgrimage. Also, Ganga Sagar is important, where Ganga flows into the ocean. All these are Tirat, places of pilgrimage. Now, those of you who went to India, if you went to the Ganga, you would have noticed, or you have witnessed, if you were there, every day in the evening, they perform Ganga Arti. Ganga Arti. They put his lights to flow along the Ganga, and the Arti is being done, puja being done to Ganga Ma, every single day. Every day, not once a year, but every day. Ganga Puja Ita. Because Ganga Ma is literally worshipped, worshipped by all of us. Now, why is Ganga Ma important? Why must we worship this Devi of Ganga? Uh, in, our, in our religious tradition. Well, first of all, Ganga Ma represents life. Life begins with Ganga Ma. If you look at the human reproductive process, you will know that water cushions the unborn child, cushions the embryo, right? There's a protective layer around the unborn child. We have some people in the medical profession here. They can tell you more about it. So Ganga Ma protects the child before the child, protects her before we were born. So that no harm can befall the unborn baby. 
when the child is born, the child is being fed, not solid but liquid. That liquid is Ganga, comes from Ganga. The liquid constitutes two-thirds of our composition, meaning that this body is two-thirds water liquid and one-third solid. You look at the world, this planet Earth, two-thirds of the planet is also water, and only one-third is land mass. If you take a boat from here, you could sail pretty much around any part of the world, because this water connects the world. In different locations, it's known by different names. If you go to California, for example, on that side, the same ocean flows over there. It's called the Pacific Ocean now. And this side is called the Atlantic Ocean. You go farther up there, you, you get the Indian Ocean. You get the Arctic Ocean, Antarctic Ocean. And it's known by different oceans and different seas, Caribbean Sea, the Black Sea, Caspian Sea, and so on. All these are different names, but it's one body of water. If they didn't have any name, that all is the same body of water. So that one body of water we speak of communicates the entire world. So you can, you can pretty much travel from one point to any point of this planet here through these waterways. And before, uh, before the airplane was invented, people used to go from one country to the other country by a ship or by a boat, as you know, uh, because of the blessings of Ganga Mata. Now, as I said, life begins with Ganga. Ganga permeates his body. And you live out your life, and you die. And after you die, they cremate you. And the ashes, where they put it? Where they put you? Right back in the Ganga, where it all began. Complete the cycle. Right back here in the Ganga. They merge your ashes in the water, and you dissolve. You go back to this water where you came from. That is how important, in practical terms, Ganga Ma is for others. But now besides that, Ganga Ma, <clears throat> see, each male deity has his concert, right? Isn't that so? Like Saraswati Ma accompanies Brahma. <coughs> Lakshmi Ma accompanies who? Who? Krishna. Lord Krishna. Parvati Ma accompanies Shiva. So all these, these male deities, they have their female counterparts that accompany them. Ganga Ma is that very powerful mother who is associated with all three, with Brahma, Vishnu, and Shiva. How is she associated? Well, the birthplace of Ganga is the feet of Lord Vishnu, from the toe of Lord Vishnu. That's where Ganga Ma is born. Then, she resides in the Kamandal of Brahma. Born in the feet of Lord Vishnu, she's present in the Kamandal, that Lota, the Kamandal of Brahma, she's present there. And then she flows from the Jata of Lord Shiva. So she's in contact with all three of these male deities. Now, what do they represent? Brahma represents creation, Lord Vishnu represents preservation, Lord Shiva represents destruction. So Ganga Ma is part of that creation. She is part of the preservation, sustenance, and she is part of the dissolution of the world as well. She delivers, she supplies that Shakti, that power to Brahma, to Vishnu, to Lord Shiva. In our lives, in practical terms, in order for us to go about creating anything, or generating anything, or making anything, we need the blessings of Ganga Ma also. In order for us to help preserve what we have, we need the blessings of Ganga Ma. In order for us to get rid of what we have, we need the blessings of Ganga Ma. Now, life on earth is dependent on water. Our food supply is dependent on water. If there is no irrigation on earth, if there is no rainfall, if water does not descend back to earth, then what happens? <clears throat> what will happen is, the earth will go in a state of drought. That drought will develop into famine. And of course, there is death and destruction. The crops will die, animals will die, we will also die. There can be no life on earth without the presence of Gangama. 
And that is true not only for the Hindu, but it's true for people of all faiths and all beliefs. Because Gangama affects every single creature on earth. Not only human beings, but all life forms. All life forms. The insects, the flies, the mosquitoes, the, the quadrupeds, the bipeds, the human beings. We all, all of us, need Gangama. We depend on Gangama for our uh, existence, for survival on this planet. See how important she is to all of us. Now, I just said you're preferred to remain cloudy. You got cloudy again. Surya Bhagwan just peeped out, blessed us, and he went back behind the clouds. You all this thing you see here, but you don't witness on a regular day. All this because the puja is happening here this morning. You must have the faith. You must have that faith. One day we were doing a puja at the beach over here. Bahin Lata was sponsoring the puja, remember? And when we were offered that gel to Surya, it was this cloudy day. The sun peeped out suddenly and accepted the offering and then went back behind the clouds too. That happened, remember? Yeah. Now, my dear brothers and sisters, it is said in the scriptures <clears throat> that those who are sick, whatever sickness you have in your body, with the internal problem, external problem, whatever disease you may have, the cure is here in this Ganga. You observe your blood, the fasting, at least for seven weeks. And the seventh week, you come to the Ganga, and you immerse yourself in the water. You must immerse yourself now. It means you got to dock yourself in the water. Immerse yourself in the water and pray with faith. The Ganga Ma, through her miraculous powers, she will help you overcome your sickness. Now you must have that faith. Pretty sure many of you have that experience before. Our Women folks who are not blessed, or couples for that matter, who are not blessed with children, again, you come to the Ganga. You pray to her, you come to the Ganga, make your offerings through her miraculous powers. She blesses you with his child, with children as well. And there are many, many cases, many examples that I can tell you about my personal experience with many couples who have done that and they have received the miraculous blessings of Gangama. Not only here, but in other countries as well. That is how powerful Gangama is. Now she has room for all your problems. Whatever they may be, how large they may be. She has room for all of them. You come and you pray. What is required here is faith, is sincerity, is devotion. And when you pray with faith and sincerity and with devotion, Gangama absorbs all of this, all of your problems. She knows what your needs are and she will fulfill all your needs. The world as we speak is going through turmoil. There's a lack of peace in many areas of the world. There are financial crises. People are suffering in so many ways in so many parts of the world, even in this country as well. The solution to all of these problems is prayer to the lotus feet of the Divine Mother. And that is why all of us this morning should consider ourselves very lucky and very fortunate that we are blessed with this opportunity to come here today before the end of summer, before the winter approaches and we get a chance now at the break of the pandemic to come and sit here as one family, as our Trimurti family and to sit together in collective worship and puja to all our deities, especially to Gangama this morning. So I pray that may the blessings of the Universal Mother Gangama be bestowed upon all of us here. May she continue to bless us so that whatever journey you may take, wherever you may happen to go, she will bless you every step along your journey. Especially if you're traveling uh, from one point to the other. You want to go to Florida, for example, you got to fly over the Gangama Ocean. If you go to any other country in the Caribbean, you got to fly over Gangama. If you go to India, you got to travel this journey across the ocean, across water all the time. That is how important the blessings of Gangama is. So we thank our Shrota here, our Bahindi, Kim, her wonderful daughter-in-law, Ashley, and the daughter, uh, Saras, and his spouses as well, Babluji and Silesh and Jeevan. Uh, may Gangama's blessing be with you all. As you can see, they are dressed for the occasion. And, uh, and perform the puja, so much devotion and so much faith here this morning. And all of us who have come here, we participate equally in this puja.
It's your prayer that Ganga's my blessings resonate with all of them and with all of us far and wide. And those of you watching also on social media and Facebook around the world, may the blessings of Ganga Ma be with you as well and your family. Whatever you may be going through at this time, Ganga Ma knows. She knows everything. She knows what is happening in your life. She knows what the problem is. And she knows what the solution is. She has the solution to your problem. All you got to pray to her with faith, she will deliver the solution to your problems. And indeed, the problems not may go away, but they must go away. They will go away. And so she restored a state of peace and tranquility to our lives. May the blessings of Ganga Ma be with all of us here. Prem Sri Ganga Mata Ki. Now we have a couple of speeches here. How is the energy? Feel blessed by Gangama here this morning. Yes. That is the idea. If you don't feel blessed, then something is wrong with you. Yes, observation. Yes. Uh -huh. The boy did not move from there. Sitting there all the time. Witnessing this puja. You're watching, yeah. Sitting there. Never got tired. I never left this position. How is that beautiful? We have the Shakti is there. Yes, that's response to our prayers right there. Yes. Yeah, that is true. The boy is sitting in the porch right there. How about that move? And the boys are listening to us. Yes. Yes. Very nice. Very good observation. Thank you very much for that. I couldn't be looking here. I had to look here. <laughs> But it's, at least you get a chance to look here, so that you can bring us to our attention. Thank you so much, Panditji. And of course, it's always a blessing to be among you. Devi Sureshwari Bhagavati Kange Trabhavanata Shankaravani viharani idam me Mama mati rastam tam pad kamali Jyoti sa jyoti sa dati chalo Prem ki ganga pahati Oh, 
बहे कैसे गंगा के धार धीरे धीरे माँ का प्यार धीरे धीरे धार धीरे धीरे प्यार धीरे धीरे बहे कैसे गंगा का धार धीरे धीरे भागरती भागरती ने कीनत पेशिया लाया है मैया के प्यार धीरे धीरे लाया है मैया के प्यार धीरे धीरे वही कैसे गंगा के धारे धीरे धीरे कैसे गंगा के हरिद्वार का प्रयाग में आया हरिद्वार का प्यार चारी ओर धीरे धीरे बहे माँ का प्यार चारी ओर धीरे धीरे बहे कैसे गंगा के धारे धीरे धीरे जब 
से करते रहे माँ करते रहे मैया हो गंगा मैया मैया हो गंगा मैया मिलकर फूल चढ़ाए गंगा मैया के माला पहराए हो प्यारे के सेंदुर टिकाते रहे मटिकाते रहे मैया हो गंगा मैया करते रहे माँ करते रहे मैया हो गंगा मैया मैया हो गारे पने आज मन भी है तुझे कौन पने कन मन धन सब है आरे पने तेरे गुन गाया करे हम गाया शिवार जय बोला बंदारी प्लीज एक्सक्यूज मी आई हैव सम एलर्जीज जय बोला बंदारी शिवार जय बोला बंदारी जय कैलाश पति शिव शंकर जय कैलाश पति शिव शंकर सब जगत गणपते नम स्वाहा ज्ञान करे हम सुमे
Big hand to poor Jenny and Lex Pinky. You see, without your voice, it could not be complete. Younger minds, please. Thank you very much. Dhavan Pradinam Kauchang Varaka Vitupakara Anam Shanti Bhauti Varaka. Everyone put your hand to the agony, take blessings of Agni Vakhan. Om Tejasi Teju Mai Dehi. Om Balamasi Balami Dehi. Om Vidamasi Vidami Dehi. Om Manurasi Mani Dehi. Om Ujjusi Ujjo Mai Dehi. Om Sahosi So Mai Dehi. Agni Vakhan Aki Jai. नीति आरती करू महारानी की आरती करू मैं गंगा जी महारानी की आरती करू ओम जय गंगा माता श्री जय गंगा माता
We come to our puja today, whatever the desire may be, whatever the need. As you all gather here today as one family, we prostrate at the lotus feet, O Ma. You know what is happening in our lives. You know what our needs are. You know what we're deserving of. We pray for those around us. We pray for our family members. 
We pray for this entire community. We pray for our world. We pray for everyone. Oma, may your miraculous touch reach out to all those of us. Heal us physically. Heal us mentally. Heal us emotionally. Heal us spiritually, O Mother. With you, the impossible becomes possible. Indeed, you purify all those with whom you come into contact. May that purificatory powers be bestowed upon us this morning as we submit to your lotus feet in reverence and prayer. Om Ya Devi Sarva Bhuteshu Ganga Rupena Sansita Namastasye 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 Namo Namaha Vameva Mata Shapita Vameva Vameva Bandhu Chasatha Vameva Vameva Vidya Dravidam Vameva Vameva Saravam Mama Deva Deva Papuham Papa Karmaham Papatma Papa Samhava Trayamam Kundri Kaksham Sarva Papu Haru Hari Mantrainam Kriyayinam Bhaktinam Janadhanam Yat Poojitam Maya Devi Paripurnam Tarastami Bara 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 Mangahu Arasadeva Sridam Pachalo Janapavani Bhakti Sarasata Sangasya Pararama Jamdhiki Jai Sarnandrahu Guru Brahma Guru Ravishnu Guru Dadevo Maheshwara Guru Dasakshat Parabrahm Asmaya Sri Guru Vila